In this video, we'll be looking at how to connect from Merlin Project to Merlin Server. To do this, you need Merlin Project version 4 installed, and you need to have already set up Merlin Server either on your own server or through a Merlin Server host, um, which is one of the services LGO Knowledge can provide. So first things first, we have Merlin open, and the easiest way to get the setup done is to go to the file menu, down to Merlin server, and then we want to set up accounts. So on the left hand side, you have a list of all the accounts you can set up, and you can set up multiple Merlin servers, and it's pretty self-explanatory. To add a new one, you click the plus. If you want to delete one, you click the minus. So here we have our demo account set up. So again, it's pretty straightforward. You just name the account however you want it to appear. You enter your server address, your port number. The default port is 7190. Um, so use this unless your setup has got a different port number. Your tenant name, which in this case is demo, and your management password. The tenant name and the management password is what authorizes you to access the Merlin server. And at the bottom, you can see there is a connection status, which is a green dot. So if for whatever reason your details are wrong, It'll show a red square and could not resolve the host name. So we'll just restore that there. And as you can see, our connection takes to the screen, so we're good to go. So now we have Merlin server set up. We want to access a document that's already on the Merlin server. So to do this, we go to File, Merlin server, and then click on Documents. So here our server list appears, and you can change what server you want to access and you can also um, access the manage accounts if any of them don't work for whatever reason. Um, so here we want to look at our hosting demo. So if you double click the file you get asked if you want to download it and um, you can download media attached to it as well or you can skip this uh, but we're going to download it all and then you get asked to pick a folder where you want your document to be stored. So um, you can create a new folder for this using an existing folder um, and then you simply click subscribe and it downloads the document. After you've subscribed and downloaded your document, um, you're going to want to open it obviously to work on it. So to do this, you open in Finder the folder where you've saved the file and then you look for the file and just double click it to open it as you would any normal project document. It'll ask for name and password um, if it's been set up for security purposes. So you just type in the username and the password that you've set up and provided. And you can also save it in your keychain as well. And when it opens up, here is your Merlin project. If you've been working on a project yourself um, on your own Mac, and you then want to share it on Merlin server, again, it's pretty straightforward. So we'll just quickly set up a sample project here and again we go to file merlin server but this time we go to share document we get the option of where to share it on the server so we're going for our demo hosting and we just click share um, and uh, if you set up any security on the document in the normal way you would um, it'll ask for a username and password um, for people to log into the document so far, we've been going through the file and Merlin server menu in order to set up and sync with Merlin server, but there is an easier way. Um, as you may have noticed, on the right hand side of the Merlin interface, there is a sync button. And this allows you to directly access the Merlin server controls um, with one click. Um, so we have an option to set up the server account details, and we also have an option to share a document on Merlin server. So if we share this project, as you can see, the sync button is now spinning. And when it completes, it'll tell us that our upload is complete. Um, and you can also use this button as well um, in order to sync a document you're working on or an open document straight to Merlin server. This video has been a very brief overview of how you get connected to Merlin server, how you access project files on Merlin server, and how you add new project files to Merlin server. Um, if you do need any help with Merlin server, 
are interested in more information on getting it purchased or set up. Um, or if you want hosting for Merlin Server, then we can provide all of these things. So get in touch with us via our website, www.lgo.co.uk. Thanks.